Okay. At long last, I am here and I am ready to go live. Hi. <laughs> I'm going to give it a couple of minutes so that people will know I'm on. I hope everybody's doing well. Everybody enjoyed their wool walk. We're still finishing up just the cleanup from wool walk. So we're going to be notifying people about, we're still notifying people about prizes. So do check your emails because some of you left emails, not phone numbers. Those who we have phone numbers from will call and let you know, you know, that you've won your prize and we'll arrange to get it to you. Um, if we did leave a phone number, do remember to check your email because there could be a prize waiting for you. Okay, we're about a minute in. I'm going to get started. Hey, everybody. This is Lisa from Annette Cheap. And I have some new kits. So that's what I'm going to be talking about today. I got in um, some, actually just recently, just, I think last week, some Plymouth Encore Color Spun. It's a variation on traditional Plymouth Encore. It's the worsted weight. But it's got a really beautiful multicolored spin going on. Look at that. Let me move that this way. Okay, you see, it's marled, and you're going to get these gentle, softly flowing stripes. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. So I've got six colors in at the moment. This is colorway 7808. There's my camera. And this is kind of like a brown, gray, black situation. So you're going to get these soft stripes. But no, never a solid tone, always a mixed tone. This is 7990. This is pink and gray. Beautiful. And since spring is here, I couldn't resist this gorgeous golden sunshine yellow. So it's marled. This one's slightly different because you do have a little bit of solid in it. But where it looks white, it's really sort of a very, very light tone that's going to fade beautiful. You see how you got the definite striping here? It fades to a softer tone, then another softer tone, and then finally you get to something that's very pale. That's how some of these work. This one is for my blue-green lovers out there. And it's kind of contrasting off a very, very deep blue, almost black, red in this mix and I happen to just love I mean I'm wearing I'm essentially wearing this color right now <laughs> love reds so I got an all red mix and I picked up this red and black with gray as the bridging tone so what is the stats on this yarn? It is a wool and acrylic mix. It's 25% wool, 75% acrylic. And I got that like wrong on my kit listings. I thought it was 80-20. And I put that on all my kit listings for this yarn. So it's actually 75-25 wool and acrylic. Uh, it gauges out at five stitches to the inch on US eights. That's 20 stitches to four inches. And if you are crocheting, it's three stitches to the inch, 12 single crochets to four inches. So it's actually a very nice um, worsted weight. I mean, it, it gauges out at perfectly worsted. And it comes in a nice pull skein. So there's no winding that you need to do. And if you're looking for something washable that you can make garments out of, 
for blankets or hats or anything like that. This is a great choice because you're going to have that breathability from the wool and the lightness from the wool, but you'll get, you know, that washable yarn because you have the acrylic built in. So the washing instructions are machine wash, gentle cycle, tumble dry low. And you do that, these will be just fine. So let me show you the kits that I thought would be really great with a star. I'm going to show it off nicely. I'll share. So you'll find these kits right on the front page on my website. And I've got two kits for knitters and two kits for crocheters. I've been looking at, um, well, you know what? A lot of the big fashion houses have put their fashion shows on YouTube and I've been kind of taking advantage. So one of the trends I saw was long line cardigans and another one, I've been talking about this for a few weeks now, ponchos. And the third big trend I saw was wraps, like, you know, big blanketish, you know, smaller than a blanket, but larger than your average shawl type of wraps. So I thought I would feature some items that would put you right on trend for the season. And like a day like today, a nice long cardigan would it would be just the thing to keep you warm or a poncho or a nice big wrap if you can just sling around your shoulders. So we're gonna start with a natty coat. This is a really lovely Kristen Tendike design. What really got me though was that it had this neat little hood with this beautiful rib detail going up the back. I don't know if you know Kristen Tendike, if you look at her designs on Ravelry or on her website, what you'll see is beautiful details, really good fit, and not a lot of complicated construction. It looks more complicated than it is, but as you can see, there are wide swaths of stockinette that you can just relax and knit. Well, let's look at this is the front it's got three buttons for the closure you see there is a bit of waist shaping but otherwise it's just cozy and comfy and if you wanted you could carry it down a little bit longer this one as it's knit here it stops just at the hips I would say the full hip Here's the back. Love this little cable detail that kind of emphasizes the waist with all the cables crossing and then it flares out again. But it's essentially a straight piece. And it is knit, I believe it's bottom up. Let me check, I have notes. Yes, it's a bottom up piece. So if you wanted to lengthen it, you need to think about it when you got started. Let me show you that, that detail again, which I just love. I didn't realize I put two pictures of the back on there. It's been a hectic day. And i offering the kit in all of the colors, uh, color spun on co we have. And definitely check out, you know, look closely at these because the colors are just beautiful. And they're going to flow right on through in really um, subtle stripes. These kits are 125. And what you'll get is a printed pattern. I will also email you a digital copy of the pattern and you'll get all the yarn you need to complete the project. Let's shrink that back down a little bit. So that's the medical. That's the Christian Tendai. And that is a knit pattern. So for my crocheters, we have the head honcho poncho. Now, 
this is also a really simple piece because it's basically two squares that you'll seam together. And the pattern is sized to fit. It's, it's a one size plus size pattern. So it will fit plus size ladies and it will fit most of your average sizes. But what I liked about it was that it was super drapey because you're working kind of like a rib situation and you're doing post stitches and that's how you're going to get the texture. So you're going to get texture and drape. And this is just the weather for that. Look at it up close. Beautiful detail. So when you combine the texture with the color flowing through the yarn, you get a lot of, you get a really dramatic looking piece, but without doing a lot of fussing with it. And once again, I'm offering it in all six colors of Encore that I have. So there's, I think there's something for everyone because I have from pastel to dramatic to subtle. And these kits are $70. And I have a little surprise waiting for you guys at the end. So let me just get through it. So that is the head honcho poncho. And it is a pattern by Ashley Conklin. That I thought was really cool. And like I said, I think it's just the thing for this sort of weather that we're having with these cool mornings and cool evenings. I saw a lot of wraps in the runway shows. So I thought I'd throw one in the selection because they're kind of cool. Just generally long, wide kind of slankets so that you can just sling around your shoulders. This one has texture, and even in this yarn, it's slightly, very, very subtly striped. And I thought, once again, the, col the combination of color and texture would give you a little bit of drama. So when you sling it over your shoulder, it's really just saying something. And because it's done in knit pearl patterns all the way through, even, you know, a beginner would be able to do this wrap. There's no shaping and you're doing all knit pearl patterns. And once again, I'm offering this in all of the colors that we have in our Encore selection. And finally, this is the Wishless Cardi. It is a long, open cardigan. Uh, it's by designer Tammy Hildebrand. And again, it's just something to throw over when the weather is a little cooler than we would wish. And it's going to play. And I think that's a theme with these four pieces that we're going to play with both color and texture at the same time. And the textures are strong enough that the color won't obscure them. And this is achieved by doing front post stitches. I just love the detail on this. Here's the back. Let's see, what is the, the length on that? Um, it The length varies from about 32 and a half inches for the smallest size to about 34 and a half inches for the largest size. And it goes down 
to just above the knee. And this kid is 125, and you'll get your pattern, a printed pattern, you'll get a digital pattern, and you'll get the yarn that you need. And, and you get your choice of your colors of from the Don Core color scheme. Yeah, I really do think that's the other thing you're going to see a lot of. I think in newer in new designs, you're going to see texture. One of the things that people were talking about was that people still want to feel that cocoon around them. You know, we all kind of want to still snuggle and cuddle in comfortable pieces. I don't know about you, but I've been wearing, you know, very, very comfortable things during quarantine. I, and I think we're going to have to transition out of really, really cozy, comfy clothes into something that's sort of like an in-between space between our pajamas <laughs> and something we would normally wear outside. So yeah, I really do think um, you're going to see all sorts of textures. And when I was looking for patterns to pair with this yarn, that's really what caught my eye, that you could do texture on a, on a deeply colored yarn, you know. But I think because it, it does these soft, soft stripes, you'll, you'll see the texture. You're not going to lose your texture amid the color. The color is going to kind of highlight the textures. but I think we're gonna be seeing a lot of coats or long cardigans, things with hoods. We're gonna see wraps. And I don't know about you, but I've already been seeing ponchos in every shape and description, both long and short, you know, capelet styles. And I think that we're gonna have a lot of fun with Let me pop my, ah, here it is, my website banner up. If you visit www.anitsheet.com, um, those, and you click the shop button, those ponchos are right on my front page there. Also, what I was saying until the very end is I have a coupon code that is going to be good until... Saturday. So for the next two days, I'm offering 10% off of any one of those kits. And here's the coupon code. It's Encore. Let's type that. 10. So if you put Encore 10 in the coupon code spot on the website, you'll get 10% off your kit. And I'm also going to put it in the chat. So it's going to just say use Code. Okay. So yeah, so let me show you the colors one more time. Like I said, I think there's something for every personality. This is 7811 and it's like reds and blacks and grays. This one's all reds. Blue green. 
that pop up with a beautiful black that burns through. Sunshine and yellow, it's color of the year. <laughs> Pink and gray, this was like a favorite um, combination for me when I was <laughs> when I was in high school actually. And deep dark grays and browns. Like I think the coat especially would be really fun with that. So those are the colors of Onco we have in. Don't forget to use your code. I think it's right down. Oh, oh I, I managed to point to it. Yay. Right down there. Ha <laughs> uh, ha. And to get 10% off the price of your kit. Also, let me do this while I remember. We are having our first Maker Monday on April 17th. You can also find this on the website. Every month we're going to be doing different workshops because, you know, it'll get it'll give you a chance to try out a craft you may not be familiar with. So this first Maker Monday, we're doing spinning and you will get your a spindle and some starter fiber. It's 100% wool fiber to get you started. And you will leave with your very first hand spun yarn. So do check out the website. And you will see our Maker Monday. We have two sessions that we're going to do. We're going to do one on the 17th, and I believe that one's at 4 o'clock. And we're doing one on the 24th, and that is at 6. So, you know, sometimes we, we get it. I don't know why our jobs want to keep us from our crafting life, but they do. <laughs> And you can just choose the one that's most convenient for your schedule. The class, I believe, workshop is uh, $25, and that includes the price of your spindle and, and fiber. Anyway, I hope everybody enjoyed this. Do take a look at the kits. The pieces really are lovely. And I hope to see you on at the Monday Makery. Thanks, guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.